Hiya guys, um, I'm back again. Uh, this is a new book, The World of Horses, Grayscale Adult Colouring Book by Ruth Sanderson. Um, it's quite a thickish book. Um, and it's just exact same paper as their other books, if that's what you've bought them. Uh, they're quite thickish, um, but you still... You need to put something behind them if you're not going to rip pages out. Uh, I'm not going to delay, I'm going to flip through. Um, I do apologise for background noise. My son's off school today because he's got cold um, and not very well. Um, so background noise is the TV. Um, I don't know how to put music on and whatnot, so I'm, <laughs> I'm still learning. Um, so I do apologise for background noise. Um, I'm not going to do I'm just going to get cracking. I've um, had a quick flip through of this when I first got it last night. Um, and pictures are absolutely amazing. Um, on this bit, um, it, she's telling you about uh, horse colouring tips. Um, uh, and gives you a quick description on how to do... Uh, grayscale colouring as well um, so yeah I'll show you now this is a book you're not going to be disappointed with if you're a horsey fan like me I've never owned a horse in my life but I did do a bit of horse riding when I was younger there is a couple of pictures that to do make me own an eye because like such as this one it's not very detailed but it does explain that they are um paintings that have been turned into grayscale some of photographs so you can tell the difference um with each picture which are paintings and which are photographs etc um but still all the same i'm not going to grumble <laughs> it's a horsey book I mean, I love stuff like this. It's absolutely beautiful. The detail is just out of this world. Um, so, yeah. If you're definitely into horses, this is a book for you. In fact, I'd be scared to even colour in it, to be honest. <laughs> scared of ruining it. Look, little fall. Some beautiful pictures. I love the ones with falls. I love them all, to be honest. But you can tell the Ruth Sanderson's pictures, can't you? It's that type of book. Look. <laughs> Some beautiful ones. Absolutely beautiful. I'll quickly flip this one now so you can see it. Another one with little falls. My phone's not wide enough to capture it all in one image. I do apologise. get a bigger phone <laughs> one, one, one that I can capture it all on it's nice that you have a bit of range of um, landscape as well but the images are just stunning I've not really coloured a Ruth Sanderson book yet. I think the texture of the book um, scares me a little because it's different to Molly Harrison's and I've been doing Molly Harrison's now for a year. So when I come to doing these, it's going to be a, a bit of a challenge because it's a different kind of texture. 
Uh, it tells you about the artist, uh, where you can get newsletters and find her on Facebook. Um, yeah, and then uh, the other books that she's got published, which I've got that one, and uh, I think it's that one, or it might be another one. And they're, they're, them books are exactly the same as this one. Um, and that's it, yeah. Uh, it looks like Ruth's got a horse of her own. Happy colouring, Ruth and Shadow, which is nice. Uh, and on the back you get a couple of sample images, uh, which is great because not many books give you sample images, which I prefer because then you know what you're buying into. Um, it looks like there's some other books here as well, a Ruth Sanderson's, uh, if you want to buy them. So yeah, that's uh, Ruth Sanderson's book. Uh, horses. Thank you for watching. Again, if it weren't for you guys uh, liking them videos and commenting and sharing and etc, there'd be no point in doing it. And I've got 55 subscribers, thanks to each and every one of you. Um, I can't thank you enough. And uh, I'll see you soon. <laughs> Bye.